I started playing guitar when I was uh, 16, mainly because I grew up watching Back to the Future, and the Johnny B. Good scene was real big for me, you know, when I was five or six. Uh, really, I've been chasing that high ever since. So when I was a teenager, I'd, I'd already been playing uh, piano and violin, and I asked my parents if I could play guitar um, after seeing a, probably in reflection, really bad local band play at my high school. And then uh, I've been playing for um, 19 years this year. I like playing guitar, I think, because uh, I'm just brilliant music overall. You know, that's a big piece of it. I'm not much of a writer. I am more interested in other people's composition, but I spend most of my guitar playing more like improvisationally. So putting on some sort of backing track or some sort of song and then usually trying to rip some sort of solo on top of it. That's probably the most fun for me. It's kind of have some tools in your tool set and you just kind of see where you end up in, in the solo, more or less. Yeah, so uh, if I'm thinking about like the progression of, of music I'm learning, um, it started with mostly like Nirvana and, and punk music, so. That, and then a lot of just West Coast. Um, but from there, uh, my dad uh, was really into Zeppelin and Van Halen, so um, it was... Uh, a lot of that, and then like the classic Van Halen. Um, but I was really into like uh, older heavy metal, you know, Priest, Maiden. You know. And then um, I grew up mostly listening to classical music, so it, it kind of turned into like shred neoclassical. Uh, Bach and stuff like that. Um, I've been in some bands previously. My favorite band I've played of all of them was like a hair metal 80s kind of throwback band with the wig and everything. You know, that's probably the most fun I had and, and I was probably 18 or 19 at that point. Did some gigs every now and again but now I just kind of play for myself and uh, for my 10 Instagram followers. So I like playing most probably, uh, I probably lean more in the extreme metal direction. Uh, you know, death metal, technical death metal, black metal grindcore, things like that. I think I probably spend most time playing just like neoclassical shred sort of stuff, just a lot of sweet arpeggios, things like that. Um, but when I uh, play for myself, it's usually a blues or classic rock sort of thing because they're much easier to, to improvise and, and kind of shred over. So that's the music I prefer to play, but when I'm just playing for myself, it's probably more jammy, more bluesy, something like that. Yeah, so at work, um, you know, I don't usually advertise it, although uh, with the work from home, my Zoom background has a few more guitars in it than it does here in the office. So. Um, I, there were once or twice where I was asked to maybe play the national anthem before a, a team's meeting that uh, may have happened, yeah. Yeah, so I don't ever see myself not being into music, and with that just comes with playing guitar. So I have an appreciation for a lot of other instruments, but this is really the only one I, I like playing. Um, I don't like playing bass, I don't like playing rhythm, I like playing lead, that's really it. So I don't see that ever going away necessarily. Um, I just see buying a lot more guitars is probably it. For someone who wanted to play, um, I would say, it's, hey, it's not too late. You know, it doesn't matter how old or what you're into. Um, realistically, uh, anyone can get into it as long as they have the drive to practice and, and work on it.